going to bring in a little light box. And what color light do we get out of this box? White. Why All light? the colors of the rainbow. All the colors of the rainbow, all together. And then what I'm going to do is set this on top to have some diffuse light. Now I've got three filters right here. And this here, this is a yellow filter. And this one is a cyan filter. And this one is a red filter, OK? And so this one absorbs blue light. This one absorbs red light. And this, this one absorbs white light. Green light. Oh, green, green light. light. So this is absorbing blue. This one absorbs red. That and this one absorbs green. green. Uh-huh. So now, if I take my light and I absorb the blue light and I absorb the red light, what's left? No red, no blue. What's our other color? Our three primary green. colors. Green. So if I take those two colors and I mix them, I get? Green. I get green. And that's how you make colors on paper. And so if you're trying to mix colors with paints. filters or paints, you know with paints, yellow plus blue equals? Green. Green. Awesome. That's how that works. And then if I took this one, this one absorbs the green. So if I have no green and I have no blue, what's left over? Green. No blue, no green. What do we still red. have? Red. Yeah. So if I mix those two, I get red. And over here, I'm going to mix. This one absorbs all of the red. This one absorbs all of the green. green. And what I'm left with is blue. blue. And this is just like what we did, except in the center, I'm absorbing the red and the green and the blue. And what's left? Black. <laughs> Black, which is no color at, at all. all. Awesome, awesome. And that's how you mix. It's a different kind of mixing of colors. The first one we did, we call it additive. And this one's called subtractive, because we're taking colors away. And if I stack them up, what I'm left with is no color black, at all. Black. Black. Awesome. Boring black. Boring black, <laughs> indeed, indeed. 